YouTube, I'm back again, Spacot 5.8. It's going to take us a little bit further into this GoPro camera gun mounts for your Picatinny rails. Now, I already showed you guys that I had Strike Mark and I had Capture Your Hunt. Just to recap, I uh, ordered Capture Your Hunt, the Picatinny rail mount, which is this guy right here. Didn't seem to fit, and it said, as you can see, it said uh, Picatinny mount for GoPro and it fit any Picatinny rail. So it didn't. I ordered the strike mark and I showed you guys how the mounts work and you know I was very pleased with them. I haven't used them yet, but I will, but I didn't do a side by side. This is our side by side. So you got your strike mark and you got your capture hunt. Now they almost look exactly the same. The only thing with the strike mark, I mean a little bit more fancier looking. It's got you know its name on the side. But you see how much bigger the other one is? Let me get my fat fingers out of the way. But the aftermarket uh, capture your hunt one compared to the, the strike mark, you can see it's a little bit bulkier. And it almost looks exactly the same. But the problem is, if you look closely, you can see the cutout. Let me get my finger so you can see it maybe on the table. Let me lean it down. You see that edge right there? Now, I actually tried to take these and possibly line them up with each other. I don't know how well I can show you guys. But just trying to line them up. You can see they're off a little bit. They're not the same. You can see actually the strike mark is a little bit wider. I have the right side totally flush. But the left side doesn't seem to be working too well. Right. There you can you can see it right there. So I said you know let me do a test. Let me, maybe it was me. Maybe my fingers weren't working right. Maybe... I don't know, operator error, so we'll do a little comparison right here and I'll try to show you guys the best the best way possible is of course sliding it on. So I take I took the Allen, I backed it out. Now I'm gonna try to do this so you guys can see it well. Let me get my fingers out of the way. Now it attempts to go in. I have this sitting perfectly right in there. I mean this thing it it doesn't want to go. Now I don't want to sit here and try to scratch the crap out of my stag. And so I said, you know, let me turn it around. Let's see if it goes in that way. It seems to want to bite, but it doesn't go. And that's the capture your hunt model. So we're going to take the other one. And we'll try strike mark. Now, same thing with strike mark. I did the Allen. I set the Allen. I pulled. Let me make sure it's out all the way. Or, get, you know, of course use the Allen. You know, the pull. Pull the Allen nut out of the way or bolt or whatever you want to call it. So we'll do, uh, oh, let me, let me try to side. There we go. Nice and smooth. I mean, the strike mark goes on without a problem. Of course, I'm going to rave them because it actually goes on nice and smooth. Now, me and my guns 44 show me this, and I mean, he did the exact same thing. Let's try the other side. Wow, nice and smooth. No problems. Guys, don't mind me. I just, you know, shot some nasal spray up my nose because it's starting to get clogged. Now let's go back to capture your hunt. Same thing. Let me put two hands on this. Because I'm about to push the rifle out of the way. It doesn't want to go. It's There's nothing. It just doesn't. You know, I'm not manipulating this. I'm not trying to make them look bad. But the product, it's just not. You know, there's something wrong with it. You know, it has to be with these little lips right here. There's just It's just not as well formed out. As strike marks. I don't know if that. I don't know if that helps you guys. You can see how the edge. Yeah it's a little bit more sharper. And more pronounced. On the strike mark. So. There you have it. Capture your hunt. Sorry to bad mouth you guys. But you know. Your, your product now. Of course. Give you guys a little bit. Do I, I didn't call your. Helpline. But I'm going to actually use this mount for something else. Because you know what. I really don't want another one. You, you know, I don't even want to deal with sending it back. I, I just don't care. So, and I'll show you once again. Nice. You know, you can't beat that. If, if you know, if they're going to make a product that goes on as nice as this, I don't even want to deal with the Capture Hunt's customer service. I mean, this is the way to go. So, we'll keep this short, guys. If you guys get a chance, get a GoPro camera, strike mark. It's the way to go. Definitely, definitely get one of these. All right? Thanks guys, thanks for watching, I'm glad you guys uh, took time to watch this, so just to show a comparison, alright, thanks guys.